After weeks of leaks and teasers, OnePlus has finally launched its 2020 series of televisions in India. Unlike the OnePlus TV Q1 from last year, the three new models are spread across the budget and mid-range segments, the fastest growing segments in the Indian television market. The OnePlus U and OnePlus Y series of televisions. The two TVs bring with them a premium design language and a feature set that may remind buyers of the high-end OnePlus TV Q1 that the company launched in 2019. The three new TVs have been launched in India as Amazon exclusives and will also be available via the company's website. Of the three, the most affordable will be the 32-inch HD screen totting the OnePlus Y which will start retail for 12,999 rupees. The 43-inch Full HD OnePlus Y TV will be sold by the company for Rs 22,999 rupees. Last but not the least, is the OnePlus U. This 4K TV with a 55-inch screen has been launched at a price of 49,999 rupees. As for the availability, OnePlus has announced that of the three, the 32-inch OnePlus Y model will be available starting July 5. The availability details for the other two TVs haven't been announced yet. OnePlus TV U1 Specifications Starting with the more premium OnePlus U1, the TV features a premium design that features a premium design with a thin bezel form factor, while the standout highlight of the OnePlus U1 is the 55-inch 4K panel on top. What makes it special is its impressive screen-to-body ratio at 95% and its 6.9mm ultra-thin body. The design, the company claims, embodies OnePlus's philosophy of burdenless user experience. Also comes with a DCI-P393% color gamut cinematic display and support for Dolby Vision and other technologies to improve not just the picture, but audio quality too. One of these technologies is the company's Gamma Engine, which promises real-time image quality optimization to deliver a smoother, clearer, and more immersive viewing experience. The MEMC feature delivers smooth content across the 55-inch panel and reduces motion blur, stuttering and ghosting. Apart from this, there are features such as noise reduction, super resolution and dynamic contrast for improving visuals. The OnePlus TV U1 also gets support for Dolby Vision and Dolby Atmos. The audio here is routed through a 4-unit speaker system with an output of 30W. The smart TV is based on Android TV 9 which brings features such as Data Saver Plus, Kids Mode and support for Google Assistant. OnePlus Y series. The more affordable budget series gets two smart TVs to go. The first one is an entry-level 32-inch TV with an HD display, while the second one is a 1080p display totting 43-inch TV. While these are budget segment TVs, they do still bring a similar feature set as the more premium OnePlus U1 TV. Both smart TVs also get the 93% DCI-P3 cinematic displays, the OnePlus TV Y series gets the company's Gamma Engine, which promises real-time image quality optimization and support for all the features that are being offered on the OnePlus U1 series. However, there are differences between the two series of TVs. The OnePlus Y series doesn't get the premium design like the OnePlus U series. While from the front, it's still bezel-less and tries to keep an all-glass front, in reality. The design here is more conventional, which to be honest is still pretty good for the price segment it comes in. For audio, it gets two X10W speakers. Both TVs also get Dolby Audio support for improving the sound quality on the budget segment TVs. Much like the OnePlus TV U1, the affordable OnePlus Q1 features Android TV platform with OnePlus's own Oxygen Play baked into it. This brings extra functionality over the basics provided by Android TV and help make the OnePlus Y TVs worth taking a look at. It brings support for Dolby Vision and Dolby Atmos and pairs it with a number of other premium features. There's also an above-average panel that is quite good at processing colors and even blacks. It's worth it to buy it. So this is our review or idea about OnePlus 4K U1 TV and it's made up to the market. Let's see you in next video.